Hey guys, hello again. I was thinking about to record this new tutorial as an special because today we are going to talk about the coils, the pieces of, of uh, armor, the points here, these skills, the special skills, the different levels, the coils appearing here, maybe you are finding and you don't know how to use them and which is the target right is some kind of weird uh, puzzle so i will do my best in english to bring uh, some light to to this puzzle okay so for that let's go step by step the first thing you need to know is this is this there's a special recipe this one golden koi which you only can prepare or cook after getting one of these golden koi it's not easy you need to upgrade first your fishing rod maybe to unlock in the research bench the skills to fish better right in any case i got one right now i can prepare this this recipe it's pretty easy if you have the fish because the rest is a joke it's pretty easy if you have a farm of vegetables right good what about this recipe this recipe you get something special in return all the points you have here you have been chosen right will become to zero to o sorry to one to one to the minimum but all of them will be available here again meaning that meaning that you can choose again nice and easy where you actually want it want them you can choose again because you don't like it because you are um, trying to unlock a special skill here and that is going to ask you for a minimum number here and a minimum number there or whatever we will get there soon don't panic <laughs> but okay let's prepare it let's do it and now let's see it remember we have 4 13 11 11 20 and 5 but after eating as i was saying look one 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 and one and now here i have 58 okay i can start to choose no 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 keep it here keep it here for the moment and let's go for the next step okay for that we need to go to the base and I need to show you which bench you need for that. The second. And my character is naked for something. Okay, I will explain it now. Good. Here is the bench. This one, I will show what about this in a second. And here we have the clay and pieces of armor and plastic and uh, copper wire. How did I get copper wire? Easy. Not easy, but my way. My way is to get electronic devices, plaques and fuses. I think that is the right way to to pronounce that fuses just in case it's, it's not right is this one okay use fuses okay where okay laptops pcs city lights tablets refrigerators microwaves uh, electric heaters atm phone boxes Home boxes, obviously I'm talking about the one you can demolish. The other, 
you will get coins, this uh, one coin, right? Uh, but I used to go to high buildings or big buildings because it's the place, you, you know, that kind of office, offices, buildings, because the odds to find uh, many laptops um, and this is stuff for the water, you know, I don't know the name in English, sorry. You get plaques from there. And as I said, um, tablets, PCs, um, laptops, uh, heaters, um, all kind of devices where you can get electronic device, uh, plaques and uh, fuses. Then you demolish or disassemble all of them and you will get a lot of copper and of course a lot of plastic and iron. Now, give me a second. Okay, now, before starting, you, you are going to see this screen many times. I hope you understand that I have to reload the game many times because with the examples I'm going to record here, you know, with the uh, coils and all the pieces of armor, the different possibilities, I need to reload and to do this. So, my apologies, but let's start with this. Now, this is... There's nothing here, Alex. What happened? Okay, let's choose pieces of armor. We have three rings. Could you organize this? Thank you. Sorry, four rings, only one copper globes, two pairs of shoes, only one, one um, leather armor, and only one helmet. Okay, let's take let's say this one, let's say this one, that one, that one, eh, nope. Organize this please. Yeah, give me a ring. And give me this. Good. Now let's dress up. Okay. Now if you press here, you have the same points after eating that special recipe, but now here some kind of magic happened. Now you have a special skill. Remember, normal skills, special skills, levels. Again, normal skills, special skills, and levels. The levels of these skills. This one, for example, is level one. We will get there, no yet. And here the coils you have right now. Okay. Why? Because each and every piece of armor, watch out, yellow, yellow. We are always talking here about pieces of armor yellow yellow pieces of armor don't you think don't you even think about to do it with blue pieces of iron or, or the normal one always use yellow okay this one let's let's see for example resistant coils four right and here one more five and here three eight and here, 3, 11. And here, nothing. 11. Do you want me to do it again? Resistant coils. For free. It, it's inside the piece of armor. For free. You don't need to add the coils in, this, in the coil socket down, right? So four, five, uh, uh, eight, uh, eleven, 
and here we don't have so if you press here 11 why we have three ignition coils here for the same reason ignition coils no what about here two nope one is three three and no three right three good now you have uh, no longer one point in each and every normal skill now you have more points because you are using armors giving you points for example the ring is giving you judgment judgment 15 points the shoes attention 10 points strength 10 points from the copper globes and this one is giving you watch out all the stats three points what it means obviously you will get three three points each you have six normal skills three times six is 18 points for free I will explain it again just in case which one it was uh, all the stats uh, this one can you see that movement speed is uh, 4% under that one all the stats 3 points each so here you have three more here, three more here, three more here, and three more here. You have six normal skills, six times three, 18 points. So, in my opinion, in my opinion, all the pieces of armor, yellow, watch out. You find with all the stats, keep them. I think we have a new one here with all the stats. I don't know. Yeah, here it is. All the stats five. This is even better because five times six is thirty. Let's change it. Let's change it. And now we have more points here. Even more points because again this ring is giving you five points each and every normal skills again we have six skills six times five is 30 points for free man for free three 30 points for free that is a lot so this for example this one if you find it no matter how many sockets you have I think you should keep it don't make this mistake than to think that you only want you know one ring one helmet one of these one globes and one shoes and the rest you will melt it or whatever nope because you can have two three four different kits of armors in different chests for example for different situations, one for the wave, one for looting, one for, I don't know, for, for going to the desert, and one for going to the north. Why? Because with the right combination, you don't need a cold drink to hold on in the desert. With the right combination, we don't need the hot drink or whatever to hold on in the north with the right combination you will be in a storm here with the zombies lightning fire poison i mean you are attacking them with that with that kind of skills they are here fire this one you will cause they will suffer because each and every bullet, each and every hit of your weapons will have a 5% more chance 
of fire attacks. In this case, why 5%? 5% because it's level 1. Why is level 1? Because you have two requirements. Five ignition coils, we have it, and five points at least in strength, we have 20. But why do we don't have level two? Because it's asking for 15 ignition coils. We have the points, but we don't have the coils. Okay? One la last thing for this part. Um, each and every time you are playing, you are getting more and more experience points, right? In the beginning, it's pretty fast. You are getting maybe in the first day, eight, nine, ten experience points, right? But when you move on, this start to, to slow down. The next point, it will be harder and harder to get. Now I'm level 59. You need to know this, pay attention please, if I may. When you get level 99, you will not get more extra points or experience points. It, it will be over. No more points. That's why you have the possibility to get a golden koi to prepare again that recipe we were talking about to restart all the points and to watch and to um, find a new configuration because maybe you rather um, to unlock different skills here okay the combination of the points and the coils you, you have will unlock the special skills and depending the requirements they are asking you here for the level the level will be O so for example this one we don't have it will be level 1 for example super armor and fire or level 2 or level 3 Okay, why don't we don't have vital attack, for example? Vital attack, what is it? Vital attack, if um, if you come here and you click here, you have the description here. What I get with this one? Click here, level one, level two, or level three, and it will only change this, 2%, 5%, 15%. Maybe you think it's not too much. Yeah, it's a lot. The difference between level 1 and level 3 is a lot. Try to think, to think about the, for example, the machete. It's pretty fast. You hit to a bunch of zombies 20 times. And now try to think the chances you have with 15% versus the chances you have with 2% each and every moment, each and every day, each and every week of the game. It's a lot of the difference. But let's go for the next step. Give me a second. Okay, now, I'm going to try an example. But let me tell you first that I was checking in YouTube, in YouTube, sorry, in Google, Fuses is right, to pronunciate is a shit, sorry, it's to pronounce, right? <laughs> okay. So the pronunciation of fuses was a right, was okay. Good, good to know. I'm trying to improve a little bit more each and every day. But let's go with the example. Example, to have a look here and to understand it better, okay? But for that, I'm going to use this bench. Don't worry, I will explain this bench later, okay? So you are going to watch me right now, doing many stuff here, and you are going to say, Fred, Fred, don't try to understand this. That's not the point, no at all. 
The point is the example about what we were talking about here. So, for example, in my case, I used to try to choose this one first. Self-healing. What do you get with that? When they hurt you, when you're, you are hurt because an attack, because an arrow, an arrow, sorry, a shot, or this uh, poison, or whatever, the red bar start to decrease, right? So it will increase by itself. That's why it's auto healing, right? So, depending, the, depending of the level, where is it? Depending of the level, uh, is regeneration per second is one, per second is three, um, per second is ten. In other words, it will be faster, obviously, how fast you recover your red bar if you are level three than if you are level one. Okay, let's come here again. You click here, self-healing, and let's say that I want to try level three. Just like that. Okay, I need, let's see the points and let's see the coils. 20 chilling coils. Okay, we have not, no one of them. The chilling coil, I think, is, let me check it, the blue one. The chilling coil is the blue one. And I don't have any of them. Bad. Really bad. And toxic coils is asking for 15. I have two for free. Again, why? Because we have something here about toxic coil, right? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Toxic coils too. Because the globes for free, two toxic coils. So we need. Sorry, I'm going to try the toxic coil first. 15, we need 13. Okay, 13. I have the clay, I have the copper wire, and I have the plastic. Take your all, Lucy, please. Do we have space? Yeah, more than good. Okay, let me check one second, one thing. Resisting, ignition, ignition, all stats, three. Uh, this combination is okay. Yeah, let's keep it like that. So, we have two, let me think, we just sec one, one second, uh, four, okay, I think it's 17, Don't look at this, don't worry. I will spend it later. I may insist. Okay. Show me. Maybe I made a mistake. Yeah, I did. I need more. But I had not no space, so... thinking give me the uh, 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 give me this okay tick 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 I think I think I need one more but let me check it let me check it first 
Why we have to? I don't want confusions. Put that away. Okay. Show me we need one more. Because remember, uh, self healing level 3 is asking for 15 toxic coils. You click here, you can see it. 15, we have 14. We need one more. Okay, okay, don't panic. Come over here. Do that. And now give me again the globes. Put it here. And put it here. Okay, the globes to its place. Its place. Okay, now we have 15 coils of toxic. First requirement, done. self healing 15. The second, 20 chilling coils. This is going to be hard. This is going to be hard, but let's try. Uh, 20. Uh, <laughs> okay, here we go. <laughs> Just do it like this. Yeah, I'm entirely full right now. I know, I know. I know. Uh, Okay, let's start doing this, give me that one, and one of three, where is it, this one, good, and now give me the sweet, and put one, two, and three, good, okay, wear it, nice. Okay, nine more. Good, nine more. Over here. We're almost there. Okay. We are almost there. Give me this. This one and this one. And give me now this one. Put that. And that's all, I think. Ah, I did one more. Not an issue. Let's see now. 20 chilling coils and 15 toxic coils for self-healing. Now it's level 1. Why is level 1? Because we have the coils we need for, for that and the points we need for that. For level 2, where is it? Memory is 10 and it's asking for 15. Okay, what happened now? We have 58 available stats because we got that golden coin recipe, right? So, tell me, memory, 30. Okay, give me 20 here. And which one is the other? Vitality. What is this? 30? Yeah, right? 20 here, right? Okay, position close. Self healing, level 3. And now, let's see what can we do with this. And uh, you are not going to believe it. 
You are not going to believe it. For example, one of the pins you can do with self-healing, believe it or not, is to swing all the time you want. Just like that. Just kind over here. Will you stay here? Yeah, okay. That's it. And let's see what happened. I'm going to swim. I want to go swimming because I don't have the jet ski or for whatever. I'm running from too many zombies. I cannot face them. And I'd rather to swing whatever. Whatever. Okay, let's see what, what happened. I'm going to force. I'm using the speed to swing. I'm not doing this, right? I'm forcing. Okay. Let's go on. Let's see. Let's see what happened here. With this skill. Self-healing level 3. Keep your eyes in the red bar. Look. Look. If I force it now, after a while, you will die. But if I do this, I can eat. Not now. Okay. Look, the red color around the screen is all the time telling me, hey, watch out, you are in the water, you, you, are, you are in danger, but look at the red bar, man, yeah, it, it's going to be a little bit slow, but I can be here all the time I want, all the time I want, I can force in the beginning, and maybe when I'm close enough to the place, Okay, let's do it. Ciao, ciao. Okay, rest a little bit. Recover. Like you used to do it with the stamina bar, right? You force it, you force it, you force it. And when the yellow bar is too close to finish, you stop running and you walk. Right? This is exactly the same. The red bar is going down, it's going down, it's going down, it's going down. Okay, 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 stop running. Recover the health. Good. Almost there. Okay, go on. So this is only one of the... advantage you get with self-healing in the middle of, of the wave <laughs> I have no words I don't need to explain it right if you have to loot inside the building with a lot of zombies even with good weapons man this is a hell of a skill let's try to fight a little bit and let's see what happened Obviously, I'm playing in peaceful because I wanted, I didn't want to, you know, to make it harder than it is. It's a tutorial, man. And I needed to get all the copper and eh, the torch is not working okay because it's in yellow. Okay, good. Now, hello. How are you doing? Okay. Are you having fun? Somebody's attacking the the bike. Okay, you know what? Okay. Put away that. Go on. 
Oh, I have the whole day. Are you okay? Oh my god. Okay, that is only one example. Obviously in this level, peaceful is, a, is not the best example to do it. But, um, even with um, stronger zombies, it works really good. Because now, for example, the the red bar is not that long we don't have we didn't eat the special recipes okay but this is all about self-healing and for the same price you have more special skills unlock why is that man why is that for the same reason what is asking poison resistant toxic coils and resistant coils we have it why why we have now for example cold because for cold level two watch out this is attack attack they will be frozen for example with with your sword with your axe with uh, a bullet with uh, whatever of the weapons you want you want to use they will be frozen every now and then in this case 20 percent of chances to to freeze them they will be in blue and frozen okay so they cannot move easy to kill why because we have 15 chilling coils and memory is asking for 20 why no level 3 because level 3 is asking for 30 chilling coils and we have 20 okay okay let's go with the next example okay here we are with the next example this guy is angry eh what happened let's hit You are not invited. Look, the fire is not hurting me at all. Yeah, you can be here doing the same shit all day long. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> but that is not the only point, man. We are in the desert. Now have a look down on the left. Where is the cold ring? The the cold ring. Where is the cola? Where is the coke? We have nothing. You don't need to drink any to hold on in the desert all the time you want. All the time you want you can make your base here for example you could you might take this armor this kit sorry this kit with the coils we have inside right now I will show you in a second just for your base here in the desert a different um, kit of pieces of armor for the wave but you can have a base in the desert man actually I'm going to do it in my in the streaming I'm starting my base will be here I don't know where I have a couple of places in my mind but let's go nice and easy and now let's have a look. Fire resistant level 3. What is asking? 20 ignition coils. 15 resistant coils. Strength 30. Judgment 30. You get it? And is it's 
it will work exactly the same if you have the right settings, the right configuration of coils, points and pieces of armor in the north. You will not need, you won't need a hot drink, a, a hot chocolate, nothing to hold on in the north and you as well can build your base in the north if you please this is another configuration okay uh, for the same price well level two um chances to attack with fire and super armor level two just a general picture the blue one okay fire resistant super armor Explosion resistant, lightning resistant, coil resistant, poison resistant, they are blue. But when you are talking about attack, they are this kind of weird red. This kind of red is this one. I don't know. I don't know how to say it in English. Let's say red. Allow me, please. So the red one is attack. Fire attack, beetle attack, pierce, piercing, right? Lightning attack and poison attack. And the green one are special. self healing we know what is it. Life leech and opportunity. We will talk about these two in a second, okay? Let's go on with the next sample. Give me a second. Okay, this is the last example, then we will go on with the bench to end the video. But now I'm in more or less in hard level, just to check how it works, because now we have attack. It's this color, this kind of red, right? Level 3, lightning, asking for lightning coil 30. We have 31 and attention 15 points 15 no sorry 50 points attention is here 51 so requirements are okay and sorry you can read 50 percent chances of lightning lightning attack let's get inside here Okay, this is going to be tricky, a screamer, a heavy, another screamer, this couple of guys, a kill, the this, the that, and of course, with too many zombies, you don't want to be inside the building. Are you coming? Ah, don't touch me. Let's wait just a second. I cannot run now. I can run. Okay, good. Are you coming? Okay, let's start. Lightning attack is really, really good. Yeah, but don't kill me, man. Obviously, if you can mix lightning attack and fire attack and poison attack and whatever attack, each and every hit is going to be, um, a couple of them will be frozen, a couple of them will be with lightning, a couple of them will be with poison, others will be on fire, in flames. But that is not so easy because you need enough rooms, right? Enough ro rooms for the coils and you need enough points. But I wanted to show an example of attack before to go on and this is how it works. They die faster. They die faster with the um, one of the um, skills to attack and it will work with the bullets 
as well. Don't forget that it will work with the bullets as well, not only with your melee weapon. Okay, give me a second and we will go on. Mm, I'm using a notebook because I want it to do it well, to do my best recording this tutorial, right? So, um, maybe I'm going to stop a little bit between, in between the, you know, the, the talking. <laughs> it's because I'm having a look to the notebook. Uh, guys, it's, it's not easy for me. Uh, I did, I, I have never been living in a country where I had to learn English. I, I was learning by myself. So, um, um, just in case you don't know it, it's not the point of this tutorial. I'm Spaniard, yeah, like um, like Rafael Nadal, for example. Speaking of which, we have something in common. We, yeah, I think we don't know how to give up when, when we are playing, right? Yeah, but this is the only thing we have in common because uh, honestly I'm more handsome I have more money I'm definitely much more clever than him <laughs> sorry <laughs> sorry and I even can play tennis much better but you know to travel the time Wimbledon to Australia to USA yeah it's 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 a little bit of stress, and honestly, I don't like play tennis. I prefer to play here night after that. Now, good after that, let's have a look. Sorry, I need to wear first the the this, and it's here again because I was reloading the game. Okay. And this one, what are you missing? One, two, three, four, what are, what are you missing, Alex? The shoes, man. The shoes, the shoes. Tension and endurance, okay, and resistant coils, anti-sockets, okay, this one. Now, let's have a closer look to the skills we know, and for the same price we will explain the rest. Now we know that we have the red ones to attack. With lightning, with poison, piercing, so you shoot one guy and the guy behind him will get a bullet, as, the same bullet as well, piercing, I don't need to explain it, right? Vital attack, you increase the chances to kill a guy with only one hit, and fire. The red one to attack, the blue one to defense. Explosion resistant, cold resistant, poison, fire, lightning. Okay, but watch out! Not only is the attack of the zombies, because you are going to build flamethrowers. So, fire resistant work not only for the heavy throwing fire in the desert. It works as well for your own flamethrowers. Okay, make no mistake there. As well, the explosion. There's this guy with a grenade. I think it's a cop lady. Yeah, I think so. But during the wave, there will be many explosions around you. So this is pretty useful for that as well. But we were saying attack and defense. But what is this? Super armor is blue as well. Light blue, right? Okay, super armor. Okay, your English is much, much better than mine. Chances of immune, immune to stagger when damage taken. Under my point of view, the meaning of this is... Uh, for example, when you are fighting with three or four four or five or more zombies for example with your melee weapon they are hitting you each and every time they hit you you will be one or two seconds where 
when you cannot do a shit, you cannot attack, you only can maybe move or maybe run a little bit, because if you are taking hit after hit, you can do a shit. With this, the armor will change the color. Actually, I think it will get some kind of light, okay? This, I think it's, that is more precise or accurate. And um, you will be able to go on hitting them even when they are hitting you at the same time, I mean. That is super armor. Okay, let's what about the green ones? Okay, self-healing, we know it. We already know it. Life leech is not complicated. If you kill one of the of the zombies, as a reward, your red bar will increase a little bit for free. Each and every time. Okay? That that is these skills, life leech, and obviously you have two levels. In each and every one of them you have three levels and the requirements you can reach here to get them or to unlock them. Okay, what about opportunity? <coughs> Sorry guys, for that coughing, for that uh, cough. Mm, what about opportunity? Listen, I always have the same doubt. When each and every time I start a playthrough, I don't know if I wanna choose this one first, self healing or this one first, opportunity. Why? Because opportunity, remember to click here. If you click here, you can read the shit. But if you click here and then one of the levels, you have the description, right? Okay. So this increase the chances of, get, of getting a high quality equipment drop when the, after killing zombies doesn't matter during the day or during the wave. So with this skill unlocked in the, in the level you get, after the wave for example, after the wave for example, you will find more often, mix it with the bags, these blue boxes and the yellow boxes. And that is a win-win, man, because you are going to get faster and more often and a big amount of yellow weapons, yellow tools and yellow pieces of armor with good stuff inside. But you are going to get, as I said, Blue stuff. With the blue stuff, what can you we do with with them? We know it. Try to imagine that I kill a guy. I because I have this opportunity, a special skill unlocked, and I got this lightsaber. I don't want it. I don't want to keep it over there because I don't know what the hell I'm going to do with it. Okay, I can one of the of the bench. I look for him. Give me gold, man. Give me gold. Here it is. Remember that we have been barely mining. All the stuff we have minerals. This is a scale. This is a scale. Okay. Organize. Okay. Aluminium, titanium, magnesium, gold. The, I think 95 of that. We got it melting tools and weapons we didn't want. Okay? Now, one thing. I'm not telling you here what to choose. Please watch out with this. Because I don't dare to do that. This is personal. Maybe you rather... In other words, I'm only telling you the info I'm only giving you the info, and with that is your call. What to choose here first, what is the combination you prefer, 
Maybe you rather to have a better attack. Maybe you rather to have um, a better defense. Maybe you are agree with me and you say, "Hey, come on, self healing is a must, or opportunity is a must." Or maybe I like this life leech or whatever. So this is up to you, and it's going to depend, obviously, what are you going to find, because it's not the same to find. For example, this beast, I was lucky with five sockets. That is not usual. Three, four is a good one, really good one. Five is crazy. But you can find even with six sockets. And you're going to understand now why it's important the number of sockets. It's not the only thing you have to take under your consideration but obviously it's one of the keys to improve your character is this, the coils and if you have more rooms for more coils I don't need to explain it, right? Okay, let me check the book the book, sorry, the notebook just in case I, I want to yeah one more, th one more, th more uh, sorry, one more thing because I want to avoid you to make this mistake. And then the bench to finish this part. Let me come over here, let me take this guy. Now press here, now press here, now come over here. Put this one over there. Okay, good. Now we have it here. Good. Now, now I'm about to talk about. Now, what I did I say? <laughs> My English is much much better than Rafael Nadal's, that's for sure. Uh, which is not too difficult. But we were saying, why I'm talking about sup support now with the coils? Alex, what are you doing? Why? There is a relation. There is a relation. Because first, here in the bench you have four options or sections here you can create your own coils if you have clay enough what is it Alex come on it's here if you have clay enough and copper wire each and every one of them is going to ask you for one of each one plastic one copper wire and one clay and you will get the one you want can you see something weird here? it's the second one now we know what about the second one for the same price here you create the coils you make the coils the one you prefer that's why in my case I rather mm, to melt the coils I find because after that yes I need to pay a price in copper I know it, but man, I can go straight for the skills I want, special skills I want. So I think it's worth it, but yes or yes, it's a must for me, but it's your call as well, okay? Maybe you rather to keep the originals, but remember that if you keep the original, they don't stack. The ignition coils will not stack here with the other ignition coils. If you find, if you find, looting 12 ignition coils, they will take 12 rooms here. So I'm afraid you will have to come back to your base pretty soon because you don't have more space to go on looting. But we were saying, what is a little bit weird here what what you are missing let me tell you purification coils what purification coils yeah the pink that uh, dark pink purification coils you can find inside the gas mask to go inside the mines you cannot make them but you can find them they are difficult to find, really difficult, but here is the thing and now is the 
perfect moment to talk about this. If you do this, your third, and now you add this one, this is attack with with poison gas. Okay? And it's a bomb, man. I love it. Because when you are surrounded by zombies, many of them you are hitting and hitting and hitting here and the other guy, and they start to change the color in purple and to die. Like flies with a spray, you know? I love it. So maybe I'm I'm speaking about I'm talking about this because I want you to avoid to make this mistake. It happened to me. Okay? Maybe you can think, okay, how can I avoid that? If I have poison resistance, level three, I can use this and the gas will not damage myself. So I don't need to wear a gas mask to use this sub part of the third mistake. It doesn't work like that. Why? Because one thing is poison and a different thing is gas. The poison gas, the sorry, the poison resistance it's here works with the skinny purple guy with the one with four legs spitting with the other ugly guy spitting green shit you became purple or green you cannot run you cannot barely move you cannot barely attack and maybe sometimes you are going to die so if you have um, poison resistance level three, it will work. It will work with that kind of zombie. But if you use this like this, the gas will damage yourself. To avoid that, you need uh, three purification coils. And for that, you have two options. One, to wear a gas mask, because a gas mask, a gas mask is going to have inside for free three purification coils, no doubt. Each and every one of them you find, I mean. But surprise, and here is a tip. If you get three purification coils and you insert them in any of the sockets of another piece of armor it will work as well you don't need the gas mask so you can for example have a helmet with with uh, four sockets you wear this helmet with purification coils and you can use this support what about the other I'm talking about this because I want to record here all the information about this. Almost all. Okay, now this other support is... I love it. It's an electric explosion. You can kill a big number of zombies with only one hit. But man, possibly you are going to die. This one? is pretty similar but it's only the half right it's going to damage you as hell and possibly you are going to kill them but you are going to kill yourself as well for the one with uh, gas attack we needed purification coils but for this one we only need lightning resistance level three if you get this you can use this soup part and you will be a bump with with your sword or maybe another melee weapon where you can insert this piece i don't know i only tried in this one to be honest on the other hand if you have this lightning resistance level three one of the most most dangerous heavies in the waves is one guy in the north who attack you with lightning 
explosions. And after the attack, possibly you're going to die. And the issue with this guy, this heavy, the issue is this bastard, sorry for the, sorry the language, is really hard to kill. It's the typical zombie, it's that kind of zombie that everybody's dying and this guy is coming to the very end of your base, man, and facing you. So keep that in mind, not now, man, that now we are in day 10, but just in case you won't want with the game because you like it and you want to find out how far can you go. I'm telling you, that one is pretty dangerous. And one of the reasons is because he is pretty hard to kill. You will recognize it pretty soon. It's blue color zombie, heavy zombie. And after suffering the first attack, you will say, eh, okay, this is the one Alex was talking about. Okay? Okay, let me check my notebook. One second. Um, I think this part is over. And we only need to explain the bench. And this is pretty easy. Let's start here. Don't even look here. This is worthless. This is useless. This is a shit. Sorry, I love the game, but I have to say it. The system is more or less pretty easy to understand. You take, for example, high quality, okay? High quality weapons and pieces of armor. You come here, I'm talking about the green one, right? And you add, for example, this one, this one, this one, this, uh, yeah, this one, this one, and this one. And the number here change. So if, if the quality of the um, yellow items you are inserting here is bigger, maybe you can reach I don't know, uh, 55 or whatever, whatever, but it's not working because it's supposed if you do this, if you sacrifice maybe five tools, weapons and pieces of farmers you were finding over there and maybe you are not going to use and you get here 95% of productivity it's supposed they are going to give you in return a bomb, maybe a bomb of a weapon, maybe a bomb of piece of armor, or maybe a bomb of a tool, whatever. No. They used to, 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 to give you in return maybe a blue weapon, maybe a blue piece of iron, piece of armor, sorry. Maybe a normal, maybe this very, this, the same weapon, this one, for example, you know, the special for assault with, um, not with all the stuff, this is a bomb, man, um, with attention, this one, for example, the same one, but nothing, let's try, let's try, look, what, look at this, look at this, I insert five yellow rare items, and the return is a crossbow. It's not even blue. You cannot be serious, man. So this part of the of the bench, forget it. Don't use it. I suppose they will improve this and they will patch this in the future. But for the moment, forget it. Just like that. Now you know how it works. Just in case they fix it, maybe we should review the situation but for now forget it okay now here here there's no nothing special to to think about let's do this for example and let's do this this first icon you come here you put one of the your piece of armor and then you insert your coils what happened here? Only pay attention because, for example, this helmet, one, one cold socket, coil socket, there it is. 
But the globes are five. Look. One, two, three, four, five coil sockets. One, two, three, four, five coil sockets. And now you can do this. Right? So this one, we know how it works. Is to insert the coils, then you put it away. And now it's loaded. Let's say that it's loaded. Okay? Now here we were saying we make the coils. So now this one, this one, and this one, we know what about them. But to finish this part, we need to pay attention here. Because I'm really sorry, guys. I, let me use the chest for all. Because I need more space. And I will recover the, this later. I'm going to put away the stuff I don't need. For example, from here. Uh, yeah, this and that and that. And put the bullets. This, yeah, and the, the bait for the fishes. And now I don't need this and the rubber. Okay, and you. Okay, good. Good. Uh, let me see we, again our pieces of, of armor because I was melting. Nice, no, okay. It's okay. So this. Nice. Let's say. Let's say that we want to unlock opportunity, level 3. And I want to make fortress coil 20. So I need at least 6 level 3 coils. 6 times 3, 18, right? Fortress coil. We're talking about good. I come here and look. You don't need to do it slow, you only do this level one I'm talking about. And now here you pay attention because here is the place you are grading. Now we have a big amount of Fortress Coil, level 1. So maybe you are thinking, now it's level 2 and then it's level 3. No, man. Sorry, bad news. For a level 3 coil, you need 9 number 1, level 1 coil. So, meaning, now I need 3. Of level 2, 1, 2, and 3. And now I'm allowed to do one of this, of level 3. Now we can come here to use, for example, the helmet and to insert the level 3. Why? Because to insert level 1 or level 2 is pointless. It's pointless. You are, going, you are not going to unlock enough special skills. You are wasting one of the rooms with a level one coil. Don't do it. Don't do it. That is totally pointless. So again, level three, level two. Sorry, I need three of level one for one of, of level two. But then I need three of level two to one of level three. In other words. I repeat it, for a coil level 3, you need 9 of level 1, so you can do it faster if you know it. I want a level 3, okay, sorry, it's not, it's not here, here it is. I have a new level three because I was I was counting one two three four five six seven nine then I came here to upgrade three of level two and then one of level three. It's a little bit tricky and it's a little bit a pain in the ass to upgrade to level three because you need to be counting. But again, 
We are talking about special skills. You need to pay a price. Okay? Um, okay, let me pause here with just a second because I want to organize a notebook. I think this part is more or less okay. It was longer than expected, but man, about this question, it's not difficult because it's difficult. It's difficult because it's many info, many info, many many stuff to to take under under consideration. So let me pause here. I will. We will go on. So far, so good. I think. I've been trying to do my best here, but it's many info. And again, I have to repeat it. The structure of this tutorial, it was not easy. This one was a bitch. Sorry, my language. But, to be honest, I had to say it. Now, let's focus. The good news, we are ending. We are ending. But we are not there yet. Now look at this. I have fire attack level 2. Why is level 2 and not different? Okay, let's click here. What is level 3? Ignition uh, strength, strength 50. Strength, strength, right? Okay, do it. And now we have the two requirements. Band 50, we have it. And the other is ignition coils 27. Mm. Bad luck. Really? Now we are level 3. Why? Let's do it again. I press C, level 2. I press C, level 3. Why is that? I told you it's too many info, but the weapons, each and every weapon has for free the same as the pieces of armor, each three coils. In this case, the third I have come with three, three ignition coils and even a strength 15. Okay, I didn't thought about it. I didn't think about it before to start recording, but it's okay, it's the same. It's the same. Meaning that you need to take again, yeah, I know it, again, under your consideration, the weapons you, you have and you are using, how many and which kind of coils they have. Okay? And it's one of the things you have to look to choose what shotgun you want. Because with the time, maybe you are going to have or to find three or four bulldog yellow shotgun. One of the things you wanna have a look if is what kind of coils and how many coils you have for free. So what is happening here? Obviously, without the third, we have twenty-seven ignition coils and it's asking for 30 in the moment the sword is between my hand I'm adding three ignition coils from the sword obviously and now we have 30 here 27 with the coils inside the pieces of armor and three more from the sword and that allow us to go to level 3 and maybe is exactly exactly what you want. You don't want to damage then with fire with the long distance distance weapons. 
only with the melee when they are fighting because they cannot move, right? When they are in flames, they cannot move, so they are easy to kill. And you can, if you can combine that with poison attack or a cold attack, when meaning they are frozen, so a couple of the, a bunch of them will be in flames. They cannot move. A bunch of them will be in poison with poison. They cannot move. And the other guys frozen, they cannot move, so do you can kill them, the half of them, at least pretty, pretty fast. Okay, one more thing. Yeah, I know it's a lot of info, guys, but I can do a shit about it, man. I can do a shit about it. More info. Okay, let's go on there. Sorry, it's here. For example, here, let's put, let's do this. And again, take under your consideration each and every time you unlock one of the levels, the game gives you an extra point in normal skills. In this case, if you get level one of ignition attack, they will give you one extra point in jet. Here. But in level 3, they will give you 5. For example, in fire resistance, we already unlocked the level 1. Get one extra point in strength. So when I was saying, and it happened all the time, each and every time you get the level 2, the level 3, and you can read it. Okay, the point is you can read it. For example, this one, whole resistance, really good. For the same price, you can hold on or hang on in the north without any shit, any special drink, hot chocolate, whatever, a blanket. You don't need it. You don't need it. If you have this level three, you can be all the time you want in the north, even to build your base there. We know it. But for the same price, it will give you memory five points more. And it doesn't matter if you are level 99 or whatever. You will get your five points more here in memory. And maybe that five points is the points you need to unlock another special skill. So when I said this was a puzzle, a puzzle, I was not lying, as you can see. The good news. The first time I came here, I remember this upgrade. Uh, it took time for me, man, to understand it. If I have a look now to the tutorial I was recording about it then, uh, my knowledge about it right now is the double period that one is not it was not a good tutorial it was a fast tutorial after the upgrade and I wanted to do it just to bring some light here but it, it was not complete like this one so take your time here to learn Try one thing, try, try the other, practice here, making coils, practice here, upgrading them, practice here, uh, adding this or adding that. But now, let me tell you, because maybe you have... Okay, Alex, um, I think it's a little bit confusing, even when you are trying your best, okay? But it's too many info, man, and this is a pain in the ass, the coils... The, the weapons, the pieces of armor to upgrade the coils, uh, to choose the skills. <laughs> it's many stuff to keep in mind, man. Yes, again, go a step by step, you will get there. I'm sure you did it. You already, you already did it with other games. Um, even in real life, you find something in studying or something in your job 
it was really, you know, uh, annoying to understand. But after going day after day, maybe in three days, this will have no secrets for you. But be patient. And now it's time for tips. Let me check the notebook. Okay, extra points. Okay, maybe you are asking, as I was saying, what kind of piece of armor I choose, I should choose first. We're talking about, for example, what helmet I should choose. Take care, because copper used to be good, but it's too heavy. To upgrade them and to decrease the weight, you need to upgrade them in a bench. Uh, I don't have that bench here, no, because I went to the river to get the fishes for this tutorial. But it's the, the green one, I think. It's the green one. There's no thing, secrets. If you upgrade, if you upgrade this one, the weight will decrease. And this is copper as well, five in weight. It will decrease as well. The three first numbers will be better for you. Meaning damage taken will increase, in this case. Critical chance will increase and weight will decrease. Always will be good for the player, okay? The first three numbers. Each and every armor. Now, obviously, memory we know is more attack. more damage sorry to zombies in the other hand we know endurance is less damage taken from zombies so it's complicated because you need a mix here if you try to keep all the points in the same in the same normal skill uh, after that i'm afraid you will have to go for a golden koi to prepare the special recipe we were talking in the beginning of the video to reset all the stats because you cannot unlock here a shit because all the points the most of the points are in maybe the half of the skills okay one tip watch out here all the skills about defense they are six right the blue one the blue ones are about defense resistance all of them not all of them sorry five we have six five of them are going to ask you for the same coils fire resistant resistant coils explosion resistant resistant uh, this is the one <laughs> Lightning uh, resistant, resistant coils. Poison resistant, resistant coils. Coil resistant, resistant coils. And super armor resistant coils. So obviously, um, resistant coils, this color, this light, I don't know what color is this one. Light brown, maybe? <laughs> light gray? A mix? 50 50? I don't know, and I don't give a shit. A shit. But, keep this in mind, defense skills, special skills, five of six of them will ask you for sure for resistant coils. That is a little bit easier now to focus what about the defense special skills, right? Good. Next tip, mm -mm 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 -mm. give me a second, please. Uh, if you understand this, this bench, guys, if you understand this, the electric system is going to be a joke for you. Trust me, a joke is only wires. The, the green, the green to the blue, 
now I link here. Now I need a switch. Now I need a special switch here because I want to do this and that. Don't panic. It's pretty easy. It's pretty easy. If you compare with this, it's pretty easy because it's not so many info. If you understand one thing in the electric system, that is forever. Don't worry about it. This is maybe the most tricky part of the tutorials. But we were saying to check my notebook, right? Okay. Safe. This is pretty important. Each and every time you're going to work here. And to work, I'm not saying about, hey, let me add a little bit of this on um, poison. No, no, no. You're going to work here. I'm begging you, safe first. You come here, you, ca you get the coils, you get the copper, you get the plastic, you get the, your pieces of armor. Safe before to do it and take your time. Take your time. Do it and after that, try it, test it. If you don't like it, reload the game in the very same place you save it and try again. Okay? Save before always. Is I think if you think about it a little bit, you will be agree with me in that. Okay. Um system coils, okay, let I'm checking my notebook, obviously. Okay, last tip, and maybe a hell of a tip, because maybe you are not going to find this tip in in any place, only here. Why? Because my Lucy is one in a million, I told you. I told you. What I used to do here, I saved before, I take all the clay, all the copper wire, all the plastic, almost all the pieces of iron I have. I used to put the wave away, you know, you go to the, I go to the um, custom, I reload the game, no wave, because I want all the time, if I'm going to be here one hour and a half of the real life, I don't give a shit. I don't care. I will do it. And only, only when I come here and I'm happy, do you know what I do? I do this, I come here, screenshot. I come here, a screenshot. I come here, a screenshot. Another screenshot, another screenshot, and then I press here, and another a screenshot to check how many points I have. So I'm taking a screenshot of the whole configuration. All the coils, uh, how many and which kind of coils I, I have in the globes, and which globes I, I chose, what kind of helmet, how many, uh, which kind of coils I insert, I was inserting here. So you can do it pressing the, um, the key in your keyboard or just in case you don't know it. Or maybe it's better for you. You can do this, for example. Let me show you. I have the paint here for window, right? And for the same price, I will show you how to do it. It's easier. And uh, let's do this. Now I will do, for example, this with the globes. Okay, capture. Hold on a second. Could you do this, please? No, I'm telling you to appear here now. Perfect. Okay, I do this. And I'm interested in this, right? I take this one. I do this. Copy. New one. 
come here let's do this um file save as uh yeah but i want this format is better what is it uh yeah this one and uh, yeah globes in the desktop for example okay now the next time i only have to reload the place i was saving before to start working that one hour and a half we are talking about and in the second in the second monitor or whatever in a notebook whatever you want you will do it fast you do not you don't you don't need to waste the time two two hours or whatever doing that because now you have the planning of the whole configuration okay again you can do it with a screenshots or you can do it easy with a notebook and a ball pen double check and do it you can here you take that you can over here give me the helmet the pen. okay now the coils are ready put this one here close now give me the globes kind of here go to this put the coils you need here then press here give me these points here these points here you get it you follow yes right okay one fun one final thing maybe many of you or a few of you are saying man cut to the chase uh, I cannot do it. Maybe I, I'm over explaining in the tutorials many stuff, but I have to say two things about it. First, this is this playlist is called from beginner to advancer for something, okay? And I'm trying. To keep a balance with the tips i'm keeping tips that i'm not showing for the moment but i'm trying to share the tips i think are good even for advanced players every now and then because maybe you didn't know it maybe you didn't think about it or whatever okay so i understand your, your point of view you want give me the tip and and that's all I want I don't want a, a long video to find out your tips man okay I will be in your shoes but in return I'm I will ask you to be in mine uh, I'm always explaining this again because mm, first from beginner to advance it and second because is my way to do it period I'd rather mm, to make a scene I don't know if that is correct you know because I'm over explaining than the opposite that the info is not enough that the tips are not enough that mm, after watching many guys starting the game or maybe in night 15 or whatever have even more doubts after watching the videos <laughs> than before start starting to watch the video so i think it's the right way to do it maybe i'm wrong obviously but in the other hand is my way to do it in any case guys and to end Thank you for watching. Thank you for the, again, I need to repeat it, for the great feedback you are giving to me. The, the new subscribers, all the likes, all the nice comments. Thank you, special thanks for the four countries with more views right now, USA, of course. I do appreciate that, guys, a lot. You know it, you know me. I'm. I have no words. 
Second, of course, Germany. Vielen Dank. Thailand, thank you very much. You are always there for me. Thank you a lot. Brazil, muito obrigado. Novamente, uh, é sinto muito especial. Uh, Com isso, mas eu não quero explicar demais uh, isso o sentimento. Ok? And Great Britain. <laughs> yeah, England, Great Britain is coming, is uh, is coming up. Is is starting to I don't know, maybe it's the game now is starting to to have some hype there. And guys Thank you very much for watching, for maybe choosing this channel for to find some tips and to find out what about the game, if you want to play it, if you don't want to play it, if you want to go on playing it or you would rather to stop. Thank you very much. And of course, this I have to say it in Spanish. Muchas gracias a la gente de España también que lo está viendo. Recuerden que voy a repetir todos los tips en el directo que estoy haciendo los viernes eh, todos los viernes a las 8 en hora peninsular a las 7 hora canaria todos estos tips los tienen, lo empecé el viernes pasado los voy a hacer exactamente igual lo que no puedo hacer es el tutorial entero de nuevo en español porque me, me vuelvo loco me tienen que ingresar sinceramente pero muchas gracias por estar ahí y por, por, por ver el canal y, y por el apoyo porque en España también se está viendo mucho y no me quiero olvidar de la gente al otro lado del Atlántico. No voy a nombrar de nuevo todos los países, pero muchísimas gracias, ¿de acuerdo? And again, as usual, no more words for today. <laughs> And I think it's the best moment to repeat that. But remember, I know this is And a special tutorial is too many info. Mark my words. Feel free to write me. Do it. Don't think twice. Write me. What were you talking about this? I didn't get a shit. I have a thick skin, man. Don't be nice with me. You don't need it. Come on. Don't be rude or gross. Neither, but you know what I mean, right? Write me, say, hey, come on, uh, the part where you were talking about the weapons and this or whatever, write me and I will answer, I promise, okay? So, um, next Friday streaming, as usual, uh, it will be 7 in the afternoon UTC, UTC, I used to leave a converter, yes, if you... In case you want to check it out, what time, what is the local time in your country. But again, thanks to all of you for the feedback and see you in the next one. And again, this one was a bitch. Sorry, my language. Yes, I know, but I had to say it. See you next time, guys. Ciao, ciao.